guys I hope you guys are having an awesome day so far so right now it is 8 in the morning like 7 59 on the dot I got off of work at about 6 a.m. and I left the parking lot around 6 10 I got home and actually no I went to Starbucks first I actually have my drink right here I got brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso so I got that in a size grande one thing that I really love about my new car is that it actually has Apple CarPlay so I'm just going to go ahead and just open my Spotify and I've been listening to like new music. That's what this is. It's just like today's top hits. But I think I'm going to listen to worship music. This is my favorite playlist that I have. I actually made this playlist. It's just called Leaning on the Lord and it's on my Spotify. If you guys are interested, it's linked down below. <laughs> because I get to pick up my brand new puppy today and I just feel like it's like a pretty bittersweet feeling just because I just lost my other dog that I had um, exactly a week and a day ago now but I'm really excited to get a new puppy and I will talk more with you guys about the whole situation I'll explain everything a little bit more but Right now it probably is really hard for you guys to hear what I'm saying. So I'll just talk to you guys whenever I'm stopped or something. And the car is just really shaky so I apologize. All right guys, so I'm in my first stop. I'm here at a gas station. I really, really, really need to pee. So I'm gonna go do that and fill up my gas cause I'm at like one fourth tank left. So I'm about to get on the toll road, so I want to go ahead, or the toll highway. So I'm going to go ahead and just fill up before I do that, just in case there are no gas stations nearby once I get on. I picked up two Red Bulls. I got the watermelon edition, and I also got the blueberry kind and there were two for five or like two for 550 which is why I always get two but my gas is also now fully filled so we're ready to go I'm at my second stop of this trip so far today I'm getting gas right now and then I got two more hours to go so bought this from inside the gas station because my contacts are so dry and I didn't bring any solution with me so I'm glad they had this because I really really need this right now all right you guys so I have very little service out here but I just wanted to show you guys that I am 31 minutes away from meeting Oakley sorry about the shaky camera I'm driving while I'm doing this but I'm really excited to finally meet Oakley. So I really hope you guys can hear me. I'm sitting in a parking lot right now. I actually just picked up Chick-fil-A and I had one hour of sleep today. So I'll tell you guys a little backstory. I got off work at six in the morning. I drove straight to here, which is Harlingen, Texas, where I picked up Oakley, which is my new dog. And I was gonna just find like a hotel or something here but my friend who's the girl who sold the dog to me said that I could just stay with her they had an extra like guest room and so I honestly was like shocked so I wasn't gonna turn that down I just want to explain to you guys like why I got Oakley and stuff so I used to have a dog her name was Bailey I got Bailey when I first came to college and Bailey was with me through so much well, Bailey actually pa passed away exactly one week ago. She got heartworms and the heartworms were really severe and the nurse had given us medication for her. We were told that she would be surviving the heartworms, that there was like a 95% survival rate for her, or at least for like any dog who starts a treatment. Well, she didn't make it nine days and so she ended up passing away. And so you guys are probably like, well, what's the point of, like, why'd you get another dog so soon, you know? And so, I'm gonna eat while I do this. Um, well, anyways, uh, 
I was just really sad about Bailey passing away and she passed away on the exact same day that I bought my new car. So the car that I'm in right now is my new car and she passed away on the exact same day that I bought this car. So overall, it was just really hard for me to be happy about my new car. Having that same memory with Bailey passing away. For the longest, I kept trying to just shake it off, try to be happy about my car and kind of just move on and just acknowledge that Bailey's like no longer suffering. But I feel like I would constantly find myself crying about Bailey. And every time I got in my car, I just had that memory of Bailey. After talking with my friends, I had some friends suggest probably getting like another dog to connect my car with like a good memory by getting like another dog. I looked at dogs on Craigslist and online and I just couldn't find one that I just really wanted. One of my college friends, she bred her dog. She had puppies and she's a blue healer, purebred. And so the puppies were blue healers, purebred. And I remember asking her, hey, are you still selling puppies? Like, do you still have any? She told me she had one left and she sent me a picture of him and I just like fell in love with him. And I asked her like how much she was charging and she told me and I was just like, I need to jump on this ASAP. But that's a little backstory of why I got a dog to begin with. I wanna do a really quick haul on some stuff that I got at TJ Maxx for Oakley. I spent a total of $31, which isn't too bad for all of these toys. So first off, I got him this, it's called the Tuffy Rope. Um, it just looks like this. It's pretty big. It has this little handle on it for pulling and then just these ropes. And I love the color blue. And then I also got him this little guy right here. You squeeze him. I also got him, it's called a Chase chase and chomp squeaker ball so basically it's just this plastic thing and when they squeeze it and they squeeze the blue part <laughs> it makes that noise and i feel like this is a really good interactive toy because i can fill it with treats and he'll keep busy like trying to get the treats out of the hole and stuff so i got him that i also got him this little lamb i think it's a lamb just looks like this and I don't know I just thought this was really cute and then I also got him this squeaker dumbbell it just looks like this and then I got him this carrot stuffer and this is what it looks like you're supposed to stuff it with like carrots and stuff but I think I'm just gonna put food in here or little treats or even peanut butter to keep him busy while I'm at work stopped by Walmart and I wanted to show you guys what I got I got Oakley some doggy food. This is the same food that I fed Bailey and she loved it. This is the kind of food that I got. It's called the Rachel Ray's dog food. I get the beef one because Bailey did not like the chicken. The chicken one actually gave her like really bad diarrhea. Also got Oakley some doggy training pads. They just look like this. This has a hundred count in here of the training pads. So this is going to be perfect for him when I go to work so he can start. He already knows to pee and poop on the training pad because my friend who actually bred the dogs she used potty pads for the puppies so they already kind of poop on them but i don't know if he's trained to poop on these or if he just poops on them because the whole floor is covered in the pads so really i don't know but i am going to keep these and use these and then hopefully he can just start learning to pee and poop on these pads right now i'm at marshall's you guys can see if you guys can see, I'm sitting outside of Marshall's. We're gonna go inside and see if they have any like doggy crate or anything like that for him, as well as a doggy bed. And then that should complete our little puppy search for now is if I find a bed and a crate for him, and then we should be good to go. I am planning on ordering more stuff on Amazon for him. Kind of like one of those big, I don't wanna say crate but it's the one that doesn't have like the top on it it's like open like a playpen kind of but it's like metal and you can mold it to whatever um shape you want I really want one of those I had one of those for Bailey and she was really obedient in it and so I really want to train Oakley to also be obedient in it I don't want to keep him in a crate because I just feel like 
that is just like too much constraint on him but if I get one of those play pens it gives him more room to roam around and just like lay around and have fun with his toys and stuff like that okay sorry about the really bad lighting but I'm gonna do a last haul for today I went into what is this Burlington and I got Oakley this cute dog bed I also got him this hammock style cart seat cover so it just looks like this and basically this is going to protect my seats in the back i went to marshall's and i got him this de-shedding tool it just looks like this apparently he's supposed to shed a lot so i got him this de-shedding tool for his fur i got him this peanut butter flavor treats and these are for like training treats so this is what i got him and then lastly, I got him some nail clippers. Another thing that I got, I don't know if I already showed you guys this, but I got him this cute little lamb. Uh, it's like a, what is this? Uh fleece lamb and i really hope he likes it that is everything that i got so far today for oakley and now i'm just gonna go back to my friend's house get oakley and kind of play with him put some potty pads around the room put his bed see if he likes it this is oakley he is my blue healer puppy <laughs> he's so cute i love him so much okay so i'm gonna show you guys his little bed that i got him oh my gosh come on come on come on oakley right here oakley come on look come on your bed buddy come on get on your bed buddy come on please i just bought it for you he's kind of sniffing it Oh, I just hope he doesn't pee on it. Did you just get your first baffy? Yeah? He's not very happy right now, huh? You're cold. Time to go home, and it is 6.06 .06 in the morning. There's my little Oakley. Hey, Oakley, come here. Oakley. Say hi to YouTube. Hey. There's his bed. He slept in it last night. Getting ready to go. It's 6.15 in the morning. Here's Oakley. I'm going to let him out on the grass real quick before we head out because it's a five hour drive. Here we go. We're in the new car together. Here he is. He's very curious. <laughs> this is my Red Bull. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> he's just playing with his toys and he's literally the cutest little thing, you guys. <laughs> Here! He loves that they squeak. And he loves his little, what is this, like a, a sheep? Oakley. All right, you guys, I finally set this up for Oakley. Ignore all the birds. There's like a billion birds out here. Um, but I finally set this up for Oakley. So it says it's water resistant. So hopefully if he does pee, which he's over here. Do look at him doing stuff he's not supposed to be doing. But it's waterproof. So hopefully if he does pee, it doesn't get on my leather seats. I'm just really hoping he doesn't pee. But I'm going to put his bed and his toys back here. One hour into our drive and I stopped by this like rest area by the highway to let this little guy out to go potty. He sleep. <laughs> Look at him. He's got his little eye open. I'm going to let him out to go potty and poop I think because he was crying earlier. So I'm going to see if this might help. <music>
I'm gonna go ahead and just end off this video, but right before I do, I'm sorry, Oakley's trying to get into his food right now. It's the cutest thing ever. I wanted to show you guys um, a couple last few items that I got Oakley today, but I'll show you guys the last couple things that I got Oakley. So I got him these treats. They just look like this. This one is a sal salmon, sal salmon recipe and this one right here is beef i just gave him one of these beef ones and he did eat it i got him those two treats from petco and then i also got him this set of doggy bowls for his food and his water this was 7.99 we're gonna go ahead and end off the vlog do you want to say bye oakley he loves my phone i don't know why you want to say bye buddy you want to say bye to youtube say bye guys bye guys